Hello and welcome to my 2D platformer tutorial. In this tutorial series, we'll be creating the base of a 2D platformer. And this means that we'll be adding some different animations and we'll be adding some different actions to this character here. Um, besides the actions and animations, we'll also be adding a um, very standard environment that will allow the character to run around and perform these different actions here. So the first animation we'll be adding is the idle animation and the character will be able to idle in uh, both directions, of course, like this. So you can see he's like moving back and forth uh, like this, and that's his idle animation. Besides the idle animation, we'll also be adding a run animation that will allow him to run back and forth from left to right here. And we'll also be adding some um, some special animations or some, some actions for this character. For example, this, this sprite sheet here has some uh, sliding as you can see here, some sliding animation that allows him to slide on the ground. And we'll also be adding a jump animation that will let the character take off and land, of course. As you can see here, he will take off and land like this. Besides this animation, we also have an attack animation that we can attack in both sides here. And I have implemented it so that when the character runs and attacks, he just stops and finishes his attack here. Besides that, we also have a jump attack animation here. He can jump and attack at the same time. And he'll also be able to land the attack whenever he's like those close to the ground. You'll see that he'll land and you'll finish off the attack on the ground instead of in the air. So we have some um, nice merging with the different animations that this, uh, this sprite here has. So um, the sprites that I'm using in this tutorial are totally free. Um, and I'll be providing you with a link in the description below for these sprites. Um, and in the next video, I'll show you which ones I downloaded and which ones I use. So they're totally free to use um, in any form. Um, if we have a look at the environment here, you'll see that we have a box here that the character is able to pass through. Um, and if I jump here, I'm able to land on top of the box. So we will have some one-way collision here. And we'll be using, using the same functionality for our platforms. As you can see here, the characters can run on top of all these platforms here. And he's not going to fall through them. But if I go down here and I want to jump on top of this platform, well, I can simply press my jump button and then I land on top of, of this platform here. So this, this is like just a small test level that we'll be building for the character to, uh, to run around in. Uh, you can of course build some bigger levels and some different levels uh, during the tutorial if that's what you want to. We also have a fix whenever the character jump off screen here. He will respawn at his start position like this. And this is the place where you would reduce his lives or uh, make it game over if the character runs off, um, off the screen of course. If you are interested in in my project files, well, then you can follow the link in the description below to download the full project uh, with the character um, and like all the sprites and the level setup and all the scripts, of course, with uh, line comments and so on. Um, also, if you want to test out this game, you can also follow the link and then you'll be able to play the game in a, a WebGL version so that you can test out how everything works and jump around with the character and attack, uh, yeah, attack the trees here and everything. Um, something else, I'll be releasing one episode a day for for this video uh, tutorial series. So um, I'll be putting up the release dates in the description below the video. If you are interested in the files and you're interested in watching all the videos right away without waiting for all the release dates, well, then you can also support me as a patron because if you do that um, and anyone, everyone that's already supporting me as a patron, will already have uh, access to all the videos and all the files right away. So if you support me as Patreon, just go to the Patreon page and you'll be able to watch all the videos before the official release dates, of course. Um, so that's it. Let's uh, get started in this tutorial. And of course, if this uh, evolves to something bigger, if, some, if people want to see some more gameplay, some enemies, some other attacks and stuff, well, then just comment on the videos and I'll see what I can do about creating some more videos for this uh, series so that we can get some more gameplay in it.